And no fewer than eight persons have been confirmed dead after a three-story building collapse in the Ibute Mata area of Lagos State. The affected building, located at number 38 Ibadan Street along Herbert Macaulay Way, caved in on Sunday night. While rescue operations are ongoing, the National Emergency Management Agency, NEMA, has said a mother and her child were among those recovered dead from the rubble. But more details in this next report. This is the second time a building would collapse in the Yaba Ibute Meta access of Lagos State in almost three months. But this time around, at least eight people have lost their lives with a mother and her child named as casualties. The house owners say the sad incident could have been avoided if the victims had obeyed the notice ordering them to vacate the building, which had been marked as distressed. We held a meeting from January. February, we had a meeting with them, and on that note, uh, a Lagos State agency, they came serving, 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 serving. Ah. And these people, we told them that this place is not safe for you again. Though. You better relocate before it's too late. We gave them money for them to leave the place, but they refused. We invited Lapka ourselves. We have pictures, we have evidences of Lapka coming to carry out a test of the, uh, for the house. We have pictures. Uh, so after the uh, uh, testing of the house, the results reveal that the house is no longer safe for living. So we told the occupants to leave. We had given every occupant money to leave this house. Some of them had left. I don't want to disclose the amount. Some of them had left, but some were adamant, saying that it is not easy to get uh, 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 accommodation in Lagos State. While rescue operations continued in earnest, government officials moved in with an excavator to conduct a partial controlled demolition of one of the houses that had been marked for demolition. This action threw some residents into confusion as authorities forcibly evicted them from their homes. While some residents say the occupants of the building would be rendered homeless if pulled down, others insist it has to be done to avert a real occurrence of Sunday's incidents. We're giving them a good notices. Shall you understand? This is Lagos State. This is not other states. We cannot be compounding problems. There are problems on ground facing people of Lagos State. We cannot be compounding problems. The update is that that property has been served all the statutory notices. The owners have been mandated to bring um, um, a structural integrity report um, and so they've been served, they've been given seven days by the notice that we served currently uh, to do that or else they have seven days or the property will be taken down the incessant building collapse across nigeria has elicited concern from president muhammad buhari who has commiserated with the families of those who died the president has also urged relevant state authorities to work closely with professional bodies to put a halt to such incidents which are described as unfortunate but preventable mary kanu tv360 nigeria